Good morning survivors and how are you doing? It's Kraken here and I'd like to welcome you back to my Wasteland Treasure series day number 31. There it is, 4 o'clock in the morning and I'm getting my cooking on here. Being Gordon Ramsay, got myself some of these fish tacos on the way, I got myself a load of coffee, I thought there's no point in me holding coffee and then I thought I'd make one of these chilli dogs that we bought the recipe for. Uh, but it looks like I need cornbread, how do I make cornbread? Oh, it takes it takes all my water. Um, do I want any more water? Yeah, let's um, make a bit more of this. We get some more cornmeal on the go. There we go. Yeah, still can't make the corn seeds. But we have plenty and plenty of corn. Right, while that's doing that then, I started making my tunnel over here. Got tons of stone i've got to about here and it took me absolutely bloody ages so that to get over here for the coal is going to be a job for when we have an auger or something along those kind of lines we need steel steel is the next thing and talking of game stages because we we're not going to find a crucible or be able to buy a crucible until we get past level 91 so we're on 81, so we've got 10 levels to go and do. And we're probably not going to find one until that kind of game stage anyway. So obviously we've got the gap pass and gas as one of the places to go and do. That actually will have a few working stiff boxes in probably. Um, this one definitely won't. This one scares the living crap out of me because I know how difficult it is. But we're going to go and give it a go anyway. How are we getting on with our coffee and stuff here? Right, cornbread. Make ten of those. Another three minutes. Oh, right. Well, the chilli dogs can stay here because that's going to take bloody forever. All of our coffee. May as well put our chilli and our meat away. Didn't realise it was going to be such a palaver just to make a bloody hot dog. But it is. So I've got both AKs with me, got the Crippler mod in this one now, put the scope onto that one, so that's making that a little bit more powerful. I was going to put the reflex sight on here, as advised to me, um, but I don't really have the spare steel for it. So that can wait until we've got steel. Uh, yeah, I can't make drum magazine, so I couldn't make that one any bigger. Basically, what we're going to have to do, I did finish off this i can't do behind there i'll have to nerve pole up behind and yeah we're not looking too bad we can do a harvest we'll do that when we come back that's going to be my indication of when upstairs is done as well is when that wall's done but we'll do that when we come back so let's get um over to the um over to savage garden and do some clothes shopping so let's get cracking Right, just on my way, and we've actually got an airdrop here, so we'll have a quick look at this. I think this is one of the... that might even be the pass and gas that we need to do, but um, let's have a little look in here. May as well put this on. I'm sure I've got those vultures about to come and peck me in the head. Right. Uh, yeah, useless. Absolutely bloody useless. That will whack all that onto the bike. Well, I left that on the bike as well. Uh, one, two, three, four, five. There we go. All of you onto the bike. Um, so we are going to have a quick little chat while we're on our way there. And hopefully not go in the wrong direction this time, because I'm pretty damn good at doing that. Um, this Sunday we have the live stream. We've already got a load of players all together. We've got Zippo making the base for us this time. Uh, Tara's going to be making the base next time for us. She's already got one that she's made in the editing... What do you call it? Um, POI editor, which is looking pretty damn good. So she's going to be doing the one for next month. If you want to join in and play along with us, come and join us over on the Discord. We've got a channel over there for the viewers game subscriber game so 
come along come and say hi we got up to 12 spaces i believe i think 12 is the maximum we can do so we've got 12 spaces over there um i think most of them are filled for this month but come over say hello anyway and we can get you down ready for next month so it's always a always a good laugh we're doing it this sunday um if not come along and watch it'll be six o'clock gmt time we can never find a time that suits absolutely everybody we've got some people will be up at one o'clock in the morning starting the stream it's um it's tough with time zones you know it is it is tough so it um unfortunately it is what it is so there we go that's what we're going to be doing this sunday like where is it am I, am I actually going the right way yep going the right way right here we go then savage garden oh it looks a bit dark oh my god well what a warm welcome that was eh what a warm welcome not really what we needed come on then come on over Nigel uh. oh here we go we've woken up half the bloody neighborhood come on taking your arm off right um I'm not gonna need that probably so let's um a bit the old choppy choppy in turn you into some glue right there we go it's already half bloody full I do want the motorcycle I really want the motorcycle it worries me though because the amount of fuel that thing doesn't take yeah it takes a bit longer to get to places but it doesn't really take much fuel at all rotten flesh right we lob that well we'll get it started if there's anything else in here worth having brass nothing right how far can i go out this far yeah hmm is that gonna be enough bullets i hope so I hope so because we do have make sure yeah they're both loaded right here we go then so this is a find we'll find the supplies right register there oh, we've got a kitchen in there Hey, what have you got? Oh, some more coffees for us. Coffees are good. Coffees are very, very good. What have we got in here? Any food for me? No. So yeah, happy with coffees. Coffees are good. More coffees the better. I'm not gonna go round and pick up all of these. It's just not gonna happen. I'm not going to spend my time going around. Oh, hello. Looked like you were trying to come out of there. Whoa! Big boy. How you doing? Didn't your mum ever tell you it was rude to spit? Sweet ass, level 40. How many skill points was that? I didn't read. Or skill points. Or skill points. That's um That's too many. It's too many. Okay. Okay. Um four skill points. Should I really be leaving that much? Get them away. Anything useful up here? Just looks like this duffel bag. No cheeky. Oh, hello. 
Right, primitive bone. Now those, I think, are better. Yeah, we were wearing level 5, so we can take those. Take the things off here. And we'll be able to add another one on, so that's good. Uh, modify you. Put you three on. And wear those. So that's good. That will just actually scrap the scrap stuff. There we go. Beautiful. Yeah, shame. I was hoping for a cheeky ammo pile or something. While we're in here. Four skill points, though. That's a lot of skill points. Fortunately, I don't have any clue where would be best to put these. Bikers. I don't think. I don't think that even hit him. Whoa! Oh yeah, I forgot everybody's running now. Knew you were getting back up. There we go. There we go. Whew. Yeah, bikers are strong. Bikers are very strong. Maybe we should have a proper look at where these skill points should be going. Right. Looks like we found our supplies. That's half of the... No, that's the whole quest done. Right, okay. Oh. Right, you... Are not a problem. Not a problem at all. Hello? You wouldn't have been a problem either. See? No problems. Bikers, on the other hand. Oh, hello. How many? How many? Do, I do like how much... Oh, oh, hello. How much this bat with this chain mod on knocks back. I do like that. I do like that. Have you got anything I need? Have you got the salmon skull crushers? I might come back with some cash actually. I might come back because we've got the cash on the bike anyway. Alright, we'll get rid of that. What have we got here? Nothing in there. Any medical supplies? Blood bags, don't really need them. Murky water. Anything this side? Okay, a health kit, that could come in handy. Some more murky water. Right, what have we got going on here? Now what I'm probably going to do is, yeah, this is, that takes us to the final loop. And, oh, we've got a um, thing there. Oh, that looked good. Volume 2 Cigars. Learn how to craft cigars. That, that's a shame. That's a shame. Volume 5 that we need. Right, I know that that takes us up towards the final loop. What I'm going to do is... It's going to be hard to get back to this safe. So we're going to do this one now. And then we're going to go back the way I came. Empty my stuff off and then come down the other side of the shop because... I might have to make a fast retreat out of this place, so I want to make sure the shop is well and truly cleared before I go into that final section. There we go, two. I hear a little snaky boy, which is absolutely fine by me. In fact, I'll bring some money with me as well to buy some stuff out of that vending machine so yeah we've done this side of the shop it's that side we have not done so let's we've done it now so it doesn't matter how far away we get where those i want to bring i'll bring all of you bring all of you is there anything here that i don't actually need to take You can live there. 
There we go. Right. Now let's go down this side of the shop. You can get some you can get some good clothes. Now I don't know. That dog is probably not a part of the POI. Jesus. See what I mean? See what I mean? We'd left ourselves and done the final loot. We would have had to put up with all this buggery when we got out. So, try and play smart here, which is, I uh, know, unusual for me. Very unusual for me. Right, there we go. Let's go. What were you hiding, big mama? Backpack there. I don't know why. Get out of it. No cheeky ammo piles or anything for me up there. Looks like there's a bag up there, but I'm not fussed about that. A few more bags. Oh, there's one of those boxes there. Those boxes are extremely strange. The stuff that you find in them. I would have expected you found things like... um. No, the glasses and, you know, things like that. But you you very rarely find anything of any note. Like scrap polymers and stuff like that. It's like, why, why would that be in a closed store? Yes, I mean, check all these shelves. Got a few things on them. A few good things, actually. Bloody hell. Okay. Well, a few repair kits. Never going to say no to some repair kits. Um... Right. Anybody over here in the camping section? That. Oh, come on. This is the final loot section. And we're meant to go up that ladder and do a few jiggery things up here and make our way into here, which is like a little bloody fortress, because... You ain't getting out of there. 2,000 hit points. Yeah. So, once you're in there, you're in there. Whoa, you scared the living crap out of me. Well, at least we can deal with you down here. Rather than having to deal with you up there. Good stuff. Right, I have some English breakfast tea. Right, let's carry on. So let's go back to where we were. Skull crushers. Yes. Yes. Health bar, yes. Right. Good stuff. So we've got the stuff we needed. Scrap you, scrap you. Perfect. We do you? Yeah, we did. Did the wall safe? It was useless. Right, up we come. Right, I've just stolen all your repair kits. Anything hidden behind here? No. I think I've only done this store once before, but it was that bad I bloody remembered it, and um, that's not a good thing. Right, well, we never woke you up. So that was somebody, because we went, oh, we went down one side of the shop, and we went down the other. So, well, you can just do you. Across here. And 
There we go. Right. Now. Okay, that one's empty. There's another one there. Okay, that one's empty. Let's see what we can do. That duct is going to make it a little bit interesting. If you want to keep on beat, uh, there's a few of you actually. If you want to keep on, oh, sounds like we've got an airdrop coming in. You guys want to keep on? We've got three of you there. I don't think you can go through that. Okay, well, if they want to keep on beating a hole into that, that's not a bad thing at all. Right? Can I don't want to fall here. Oh, bugger. Okay. Right, let's put another frame down. Right, there's another one there. That's empty as well. Where are these guys? There's one there, one there. Is it going to be possible for me to step my way down here? Because if we get a group of radiators in here, it's um, it's pretty much game over, and they're going to be in that door there. Um. Okay, there's just me wrecking the joint. Where are we? Loaded. Loaded. Wow. Okay. They weren't empty. Thanks for that game. Bloody thumb pimps. Right, well... We know... That ain't going to sort you out. No, it's just going to piss you off, isn't it? Obviously, the problem we've got with these guys is they regenerate their health. And that's how much killing he took. You imagine that down there right we've got a biker here no don't you don't you take my loot still not dead i don't think he's he's still not dead There we go. That was a whole magazine. A whole magazine into him. Ridiculous. Absolutely bloody ridiculous. Right, they've made a hole there. I can deal with them. Was there one then? No, there wasn't. Right, so you're, f you're fully loaded, but we haven't got many bullets left. But you're fully loaded as well. Right. Let's go over. Got four of you causing a bit of a ruckus out there. Right. Bugger me.
That scared the living bejesus out of me. Right, what are you guys doing? See what I mean? Four radiators. I know I had to cheese out a little bit, but you imagine if I just stayed there. There's no way I do not have the firepower, I do not have the armor for taking on that kind of... Oh, what, what are you doing, love? Just stay down. Christ's sake. Ooh. Right, let me get this opened up. Right, here we go then. They had nearly knocked out this bottom one anyway, so I've done that myself. Right, wear that. Use the eye candy. What have we got here? Food. Why, why have you got food in a... In a closed shop. We've got an engine. Okay. Not too bad. I like engines. Engines are good. What have we got in this one then? Leather. We got what we got is tier six. That's pretty damn good. So we'll definitely be replacing R1 with that one. Ammo pile. Okay. Never say no to that. Um a few more frames there. Right, what have we got over here? Anything on that one? No. That one? Steel leg armor. We've got level 4 steel leg armor. But it's still not bad. Cash register. A few jukes. That one we can't use. More over here. Okay. We actually got anything in here for all the trouble you guys nearly caused me? No, it doesn't look like it, but have we got something hidden up there? What is going on? How how did I put a frame above me? Neat party trick cracking, but um we, we go here? No? No, done it above me again. Okay, I'm not sure if there's A way we're meant to get up there? Does it look like it? Or are you just trying to trying to cause me some issues? No, it doesn't look like we've got anything up there. Okay, well We completed it. We didn't ever even check that one. Yeah, some food. There we go. So was it really worth it? Well at least I didn't die least I didn't die but I would have done if I fell down there we do not have the guns um we we just don't we can't be doing POIs like that yet no rad removers or anything like that you know I just put two magazines into those guys to get it done which is redonkulous um can I go back that way please make it in that direction so don't go down there, Kraken. Right, let's get back to the trade and let's hope he rewards us something bloody good for trying to... for nearly killing ourselves. Well, bugger me backwards. That took a freaking age to get back here. Uh, anyway, what have you got for me? Oh, you've got some sugar butts as well. Eye candy. Uh, definitely get the coffee. Right, let's get you on for the XP. Right, we found some repair kits, so we'll definitely repair you while we're in there. Let's we'll repair you and repair you, because we're going to be selling you. Tier 6 will sell you, you know. We'll repair you anyway. We're going to definitely keep hold of you, though. And you're going to be worth... Oh, 165, actually. No, we'll keep hold of you. Right. Well, I'll do business with you, long as you're not a thief. Uh, well, I you did steal from you, so... Shit now. Well, you right, what do we got here? Armour piercing. That might do more damage against those bikers. Um, and those are no use to me whatsoever. Do you have a job? What have you got? Have you got anything decent for me? Um, you still want tier 1 buried you supplies. Modern House 5. services well. Okay, where is this modern house five then? Is that the one? That's where that airdrop landed. Yeah. 
So the modern house will be this one here, and then up here, yeah, that's the passing gas. Sweet as. Right, okay then. Let's sell you some stuff. Right, probably should have taken the sugar butts first, but hey ho, what have you got for me? Right, uh, day 34, so day 31, so you, yeah, you restocked. Um, right, that means we can craft M60s. Good right, well, I just messed up big style, so let's actually take that. I should have I should have sold everything with that. But that will be worth having. Buy the gunpowder. Don't need any of that. I'd like to be able to make that. Dart traps, I still don't want to put dart traps in. Um cobblestone because you're so cheap. To be honest, with the amount of mining I've done, let's, let's not spend the small amounts of stuff. Pistol P Volume 6. Ha! We found it. We have found it. Yes. Yes. We'll buy you. Buy it all. Buy it all. There we go. We are not going to have to worry about standing on landmines ever again. The one thing you have got to worry about, though, is other people standing on landmines. Is that is an issue. Batter up volume one. Do 10% more damage with clubs. Thank you very much. Oh. Okay. Game. I take it back. I'm out of money. I'm out of money, but I've got more money and I'm coming back. That's right. Do the math. Do the maths. There we go. Landmines. Nine mil. More damage with clubs. M60s. What a day. What a day. Let me give some more money. This is why I keep the money on my bike. Come on. Give me the money. There we go. Another 20,000. So we've got 40,000 dukes on us. Contact grenades. That means I can extend out the back of my base. And do that. Now... The downside is how expensive they are, because they are Time not cheap. On. Yeah, I'm moving on. Don't you worry about that, buddy. I'm going to read that. So, contact grenades are not cheap. 14 gunpowder, but they take springs, forge iron, and they take mechanical parts. So, we're going to have to put some more points into salvage operations, probably. Maybe another point into this. But the main, and using that hacker's candy as well. In fact, did he have a hacker's? Yeah. There we go. Two hackers. Get our mechanical parts up. Get our springs up. So we're going to have to start taking some beds apart. But you make 20 of those for your horde night. That, I love using them because you can just clear out a big load of zombies. And then quickly jump in and do your repairing. Guys... What an end to the day. Couldn't ask for a better end after nearly getting two to bits in the bloody clothes shop. Big thumbs up on the video. As always, don't forget, live stream this Sunday. You know, come along, enjoy it, be a part of it. Totally up to you. Down below is the link to my Discord. Even if you don't want to join in, come over, say hello on Discord. Great bunch of guys over there and girls. Come on over, say hello. It's always a good, good time. That's where I'm going to leave you for this episode. Take care of yourselves, and I'll see you next time. Take it easy.